Hey guys, I am Black Ops Amazing. Welcome back to another Zombies video, and today we finally have the quotes for our characters in Garad Karu. Since the PC version has been released, obviously, all the time we can go in the files and just extract this information, which gives us crystal clear quotes from our characters. Now, I've been having a look through and I've noticed something very interesting. Every time the blood vials are brought up to Richthofen by one of our three characters, he always seems to dodge the question. We know this is a secret, but these kind of give you a better idea about them. And then I've also compiled some ones from Dr. Monty and a few other things which should give us an interesting tale on our zombie storyline. So as always, I hope you enjoyed the video. If you want to take a second to drop a like rating, that'd mean an awful lot. But anyway, hopefully you enjoy. Let's get into it. I'm not sure if Rick Toffin can ever be redeemed, Tech. He's got a lot of blood on his hands. Even if his own redemption is impossible, he still seems eager to make amends. Still don't know exactly what he's up to, though. Especially that business with the blood vials. I believe there is bigger picture that we are not yet able to see. You know the saying, Tech. Time will tell. Indeed. Time will unveil those mysteries. It has shrouded for so long. So we start off with Dempsey and Takio talking. They both say that they don't think what Richtofen has done can ever be redeemed, but it still looks like Richtofen wants to, for some reason, make amends. Which to me has always really been quite strange. We had Richtofen, which was this bad, sadistic character. In Origins on our new timeline, he found out about the events that would go down and set out to stop them with Maxis, but we never knew really what was in it for Richtofen. Yeah, him having a better future, but he's always had this twist side to him. We know that we are in a new timeline with Origins, but you can still see his former self in this version start to come out, especially because of the exposure to 115. This evil side of Richtofen is still deep down within there. We kind of get a little hint towards it, so I've always wondered what's really in this for Richtofen. Why is he actually going out to do this? I always thought that was a little bit strange, but Dempsey continues with saying we don't exactly know what he's up to though, especially the business with the blood vials, and then Takio says, I believe there is a bigger picture that we are not able to see. And then they say time will unveil the mysteries, which we know is going to be in DLC for Revelations. Whether or not Richtofen needs to use the blood vials, we don't yet know. But I'm guessing since we've got them purely because of gameplay aspects that we are going to be using the blood vials, and whatever the reason is as to why Richtofen has got them, uh, that event is going to go down with him, Monty, and most probably Maxis. So, Richtofen, are we going to talk about the blood? You can, if you want. So I don't imagine it will be a particularly riveting conversation. You took us on a little whistle-stop tour of some other locations. Said we all needed the blood vials. I was right. This subject is very boring. Can we talk about something else? Okay. Maybe you start telling me about your end game. Specifically, what you plan to do with all our souls rattling around in the summoning key. The house. We have to get to the house. We'll be there soon. Dempsey then asks Richtofen if he wants to talk about the blood. Richtofen replies, you can if you want, but I don't imagine it's going to be an interesting conversation because for obvious reasons, Richtofen doesn't want to talk about it. He knows that Dr. Monty is listening and if he's got these blood vials as a backup plan, as his insurance policy to, in what I think, fight back against what Maxis might do to him. Obviously, he doesn't want to talk about the blood because if Monty is listening, then his whole plan, the reason as to why he got them, there's going to be no point to it. So, obviously, he's not going to talk about the blood vials because it's a secret. Hence why he keeps avoiding the question when it is brought up to him by the other three characters. Dempsey says you took us on a little little stop tour of some other locations. You said we all needed the blood vials. But once again, Rick Toffin cuts him off. But this tells us, which we didn't know before, that our characters went to multiple different locations when they traveled in Zetsubo no Shima. We knew they teleported away to somewhere to get these blood vials, but this shows they went on multiple different stops. They most probably went to multiple different locations to collect these blood samples. Where exactly that was, was it a different location for each character? Apart from that, we really know nothing about them because Richtofen is choosing for good reason not to talk about them. And then we have one of the final quotes where Richtofen says, I'm going to have to ask you to trust me, Nikolai. The less we speak of the blood, the better. It's supposed to be a secret. You have not explained the purpose behind our last journey. Uh, you know what I am referring to. Trust me, Nikolai. The plan will succeed. Do not worry your ugly little Russian head any further. 
doctor's orders. Trust me, Nikolai, the less we speak of the blood, the better. After all, it's supposed to be our little secrets. But then the interesting thing is Nikolai replies, you have not explained the purpose behind our last journey. As we know, their last journey was traveling away to collect the blood vials in Zetsubo no Shima. But when Nikolai says it, he kind of sounds worried or kind of depressed. You see, all these characters are interested as to why they have them and why they went to those locations, yet no one, especially Rick Toffin, is talking about them. You can see it's all very secretive. When Takio asks Rick Toffin about the blood vials and why they have them, Rick Toffin says, don't worry, their true purpose will become clear. Assuming it comes to that, I hope it doesn't. Like I said, we know Richtofen has got the blood as his insurance policy. We know that Maxis is keeping a secret from Richtofen, which we learned in Zetsubo no Shima. We don't know what the secret is, but I believe it could well involve Richtofen being killed. That Maxis may have to kill him or somehow get rid of him when we go to the house in Revelations. Maxis is keeping this a secret from Richtofen, but Richtofen already knows about the secret as we learn in his memories trailer. And as he says, don't worry Takio, the blood vials, their true purpose will be revealed in Revelations if we need to use them. If Maxis or maybe even Monty does decide to kill Richtofen, then he's saying, you will then see what these blood vials are for because I am going to use them. But he says, I hope it doesn't come to that. I hope Maxis doesn't kill me if that's what his big secret is. I mean, his secret really could be anything else. We know Eddie is in the house as a child, so I suppose suppose that could be the secret. But Richtofen, for some reason, as I said at the beginning, wants to make amends. We've known him since the very beginning as this evil, sadistic doctor. In Origins, we have him as this good guy who wants to do right. But to me, it all seems very strange. I want to trust Richtofen, but I know there's still this evil side to him somewhere down there. We're seeing Garad Karuvi, Takio, and Dempsey especially now trust ripped off and they can see what he's done and how far he's led them and they seem to trust him but yet Nikolai says what purpose for the blood vials the ones we retrieved after our journey to the island worry not their true purpose will become clear assuming it comes to that which I hope it won't Richtofen's goals are still unknown we are bound together only by convenience respectfully Nikolai I disagree. I believe that Richtofen will betray us again. Mark my words. That he still believes in the end Richtofen is going to betray them. Nikolai is the only one out of the three that doesn't trust him. And Nikolai still believes that they are going to be betrayed in Revelations. That Richtofen is still this selfish character and he's actually doing all this for his own purpose. Maybe to gain more power, we have no idea. Let me know in the comments, do you think Richtofen is this good guy now? Is he doing this for the team? Or do you believe in Revelations he's still got this bad side to him and he's going to betray us in the end? Now at the end of the game we know we have Monty come in and also he starts to talk to us throughout the game whilst we're we're playing. When our characters go down, he will talk to us personally. Now, this is what he says to Richthofen. So, Richthofen, I'm kind of surprised that you've gone along with him this far. Didn't you absolutely despise him at one point? Anyway, keep a close eye on him. I think he's up to something. I have to admit something to you, Edward. Something I've never, ever, ever had to admit to anyone before. It's really quite embarrassing. You ready? Well, here it is. I don't understand you, matey. I don't understand a single thing about what makes you tick. You are the closest thing to an absolute distillation of obtuse obstructionism and unparalleled maniacal chaos in human form as it is possible to imagine. Look. I know you've had a lot to deal with. I know how hard you've been trying, but I really can't be sure exactly why you're doing it. I mean, it's not as if you owe Maxis anything, is it? I don't know. Maybe some of the paranoia is starting to rub off on me. But let me tell you this, my little German friend. I've got my eye on you. Monty basically says to Richtofen, why? Are you doing this? He's bringing up the point that didn't he used to be enemies with Maxis or, you know, not the best of friends as we saw in the Giants where Richtofen teleported Maxis and Samantha away. And Monty, in the same way as I am, is questioning the reason as to why Richtofen is really doing this. He used to hate Maxis, but now all of a sudden he wants to help him out. But then it seems like Monty's trying to stir things up. He says, I feel that Maxis is up to something, keep a close eye on him. From what I've gathered so far, it seems like Maxis and Monty have been meeting together, maybe working together. We know that Maxis has a secret and I 
somehow feel that Monty knows this secret of Maxis's. And now in this quote, Monty is saying to Richtofen, be careful of Maxis because I feel he is holding something from you. To me, it kind of sounds like Monty is trying to stir things up between Richtofen and Maxis, which could give him an excuse, or Maxis an excuse to kill Richtofen in Revelations. Richtofen has been trying to keep these blood vials a secret from Monty and Maxis, as this is his insurance policy. If they find out, then him collecting the blood vials was pointless because he can't then use it against them. And as you can see, he's been trying his very best to keep it a secret, to not talk about it, even though the other characters are curious. And Monty says, be careful, Richtofen, because I have my eye on you. We know Monty has been listening to our characters, has been keeping a close eye on them, which also makes me wonder, we have Maxis keeping a secret from Richtofen, Richtofen keeping a secret from Maxis. But does Monty know about Richtofen's secret? I mean, if Monty has been watching our characters, then would he have seen them teleport to somewhere to collect these blood Files, which could mean maybe Monty is also keeping a secret from Richtofen. We have a massive circle of secrets here, guys, and it's not good. We should just all let it out. It's not good for the family. So, besides the changes to your own outlook, have you noticed a change in Richthofen? Dempsey? Well, I'm not trying to stir things up, but does it seem to you like the two of them may be scheming between themselves? But then once again, at the end, it seems like Monty is trying to stir things up because he says to Takio that Dempsey and Richtofen seem to have something going on. It seems like together, those two are coming up with a plan. It almost seems like Monty wants these characters to fall out. So when we get to Revelations, maybe they will end up killing Richtofen or it'll give Maxis an excuse to kill Richtofen. I feel it's going to have something involved or to do with killing uh, ripped off and all getting river, rid of him. So there we go guys, definitely some interesting quotes relating to the blood vials and the secret that Maxis and Richtofen and Monty are trying to keep and how Monty seems to be trying to stir things up and telling Richtofen that it seems like Maxis is up to something, telling Takio that, you know, Dempsey and Richtofen have something going on between them. Everything seems to be heating up as we get to Revelations and we finally go to the house. Honestly, this last DLC seems extremely freaking interesting and I cannot wait until we start getting little teasers about it. So there we go. Hopefully you have enjoyed the video. Drop a like rating. If you have, that would be much appreciated. Make sure you are subscribed to the Zombies channel for more daily videos. And of course, I will see you in the next video. Thank you for watching, guys, and peace out.